Hi everyone, this is Carolyn, and today we are journaling with the Illustrated Faith Summer in the Psalms Volume 1 Bible Journaling Kit, and we're journaling Psalm 139-2. All products I use are listed in the description below. Today I'm doing something a little bit different. I am painting with a sponge. So I got this, it's like a little sea sponge that you can buy. Um, I'll, I'll link it below, but I'm just dipping it in the acrylic paint and painting like a background on the page. And then I'm gonna go in with a dryer and this stencil came with the kit. I'm gonna tape it down and then I'm gonna go in with another sponge and paint it yellow. Psalm 139.2 says, You know my sitting down and my rising up. You understand my thoughts afar off. So I thought what better and perfect way to journal about God knowing our rising and our sitting and our thoughts than stenciling these little things that could represent like the sun rising. It just fit. And while I was meditating on this verse, I was thinking, God is with us every second of the day. If he knows our sitting down, he knows our rising up, he knows every thought, and he is with us every second of the day. He sees us. He understands our thoughts, our emotions, even more than we do. I remember one time I was in a situation that it just, I was in great fear and so much fear that I couldn't even speak at the moment. But in my mind, I cried out to God, help me, Jesus. And immediately, without me even thinking about it, a scripture came out of my mouth. I was able to speak and that situation turned around. He knows our thoughts. He hears our cries, even in our minds. Now I'm going in with this stamp and I put the word no in the stamp and then I'm writing out uh, the rest of the verse and then I'll, I'll stamp uh, rising. And I, I really don't love my handwriting. It's something I could work on. But, you know, God sees our hearts. When we want to journal creatively, it does not have to be perfect. God does not expect perfection from us. What he cares about us journaling and meditating on his word or being creative with his word, he cares about what's going on in our hearts. So if you're afraid of it looking messy or making a mistake, remember that God cares about what's going on in your heart. So I wrote out, uh, I stamped out the rising and and then wrote out up, and this stamp, the psalm, came with the kit. The other stamps did not come with the kit. I actually got them from By the Will for God. Um, and then I'm writing the reference, and I wrote it on the top because there is just a little bit more room, but it does kind of look a little different, so I don't know if I'll do that again. And then I tore this little piece of paper has like the the sleeping sun and the awake sun and what a perfect picture of he knows our sitting down and our rising up he knows when we're when we're resting and when we are up and working so i'm just playing with where i'm going to put the ephemera now on this page and then i'm going to start gluing down the pieces and as i was meditating also on this verse i was thinking Remember that God loves us so much, he cannot take his eyes off of us. He has not abandoned you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. It says this in Hebrews 13, 5. And it also says in Numbers 23, 19, that God is not a man that he should lie. It goes on to say, has he not spoken and will he make it good? Has he not spoken? and he will make it good. The Bible says that God keeps his word. That is his character. 
We often have been let down by father figures or other people, and we've learned not to trust. But know that we can trust God. He will come through for you. Even if you can't see it right now, even if it takes time, He will come through. He is not a man that he should lie. He's not done with the situation yet. So now I have put down my ephemera and then there's these little um, word fetty stickers that come with the kit. And I just love them. It goes with the psalms that are in the kit. Takes out some of the words and just puts word fetty. So the words that I'm putting down are fearfully and wonderfully made. That's in Psalm 139. Uh, I put down, you go before me. I put down, he sees me. And then search me, O God, and know my heart. And that is a prayer at the end of Psalm 139. Then I'm writing out my own prayer from for this uh, page. And it says, Lord, I lift up to you every concern. I thank you that you see me, that you are listening, and that your purposes will come to pass. I love you, Lord. Amen. So that is my page. Did you know that I've written several books and Bible studies? You can find more information in the description below. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe for more Bible journaling videos.